Whoop whoop. In the summer sun. Do I still know how to vlog? It's been a while. It's been a while. <coughs> Excuse me. So, um, what have I been up to? Where am I? What is this? This is a plot of land in the center of Portugal. And on which I made a bit. What is accepted? Well, it was the asking price, so no surprise there. Um, I've been here once. Well, actually, I still need to make the first payment, so nothing is really definite. But um, I wanted to take another look around. And I wanted to take you guys with me. It's really quiet here. This is a, um, in the background is a very small village where maybe still three people live and maybe four habitable houses and a lot of ruins. As is this. One of the two ruins of this plot. The second ruin is uh, hard to find. <laughs> but it still has a, a roof and stuff, so we should be able to find it. So, um, border marking is here, past the house. I'll show you a nice view with the drone, I'll fly it up later. So here past the house, uh, this piece of land with another ruin, uh, maybe next year. And then it extends way over there. And this part, the, um, this road is public access, but it also belongs to this property. And this is the road into uh, a forest. I haven't been there. On the map it looks really cool. Nobody around. One major big forest here. Maybe I should put the camera a little bit like this. See, maybe I did unlearn to vlog. <laughs> there are some flies here. But hey. So, um, the road. That's the other border. And uh, funny enough, this nice looking little house does not belong to the property. They still have to part it from the land because it's now from the same owner. But uh, they don't want to sell it. Not yet. So, let me take you down here first. So this is the front of the ruin. Yeah, it needs some work. Uh, like, uh, like Ken would say, it uh, needs a little bit of paint. Oh no, it wasn't Ken, it was the Portuguese guy. He said it just needed a little bit of paint. Now, as you can see, the construction is not so good. This part is like falling down a little bit. So, all of three. So, yeah, this border is maybe still a little bit unclear. Although, there's a, no, that's not a cornerstone, that's just schist. So it should be going from right beside the house. Ah. So yeah, you see here definite border marking. Well, not a marking, but it's lower there. Going further down. Down, down. It should be um, 5,600 square meters. But I draw it out on uh, Google Maps and I don't get any further than 4,700 meters, so I'm missing a little bit. So the other property edge is this 
sort of stream. Although I don't hear any water running at the moment. But it's a little uh, overgrown. But you can see here also there's like an exact corner, so that's probably the exact uh, border. Whoops! Oh. <laughs> I thought maybe my car was in the way, there's a tractor coming, but he's going the other way. I don't think anybody is using this road. Maybe loggers, or maybe people who own a piece of land there with the trees. But I don't think there's any vegetables and stuff. So this is something else for a weekly vlog, huh? Exciting stuff! No idea where I'm going here. Oh, that's quite a way down. There is some water in there. But it's not much. <laughs> I uh, do you see that roof sticking out of the grass? <laughs> I uh, may have found the second ruin. <laughs> but before we're over there, it takes a little walk. So all the way past the stream, and the stream goes then around up to there. So this is uh, what they call in Portugal rustic land. So it's not um, inside the city and it's not it's not urban as they say. Different plots have different advantages. I think there's something here that's not so good for my lungs. <coughs> Nobody ever comes here, so all kinds of stuff flying around. So here's the stream still. I need to see where that's coming from because it doesn't have much water now. Maybe somebody's holding it up. Look, here you can see the ruin better. It's like hiding into the mountain. Well, mountain. <laughs> into the hill, hillside. We need to see where the property ends. Here also, past the stream. And then somewhere over here, I think it should end. It's clear on the, on the drawing from the from the town hall, but um, I don't think I can find a cornerstone here. <laughs> Although I'm willing to try anything. Well, well, there's a well. That definitely needs to be cleaned. There should be more than enough water in there. But I think it's not coming up because of all the dirt. It hasn't been used for a while. So is there a possibility to see what is the border here? I don't think so. I will look at the map later. It seems like this is still part of it, but... Well, the well is. So at least until the well. And if you have like a small overview, there, behind the other one, behind the other ruin, until there. So I think for me to start with, that is more than enough. Some vegetables, a goat, and some hippies. What more do you need? So this is the second ruin. They made here a sort of wall to make a, a terrace up, the, up there, I think. And uh, 
the ruin is just set into the mountain, to the hill. If we can capture something from the inside. So yeah, that is really small. But we can make the roof a little higher. Where's my screen? We can make the roof a little higher and we can make a window. And um, maybe a wall falls down, we need to put back up. Yeah, you can see. It's so cute. It's like one with the mountain. And that was a full memory card from the vlogging camera. Now on my mobile phone. After going <sighs> up and down. It's quite hot here. No shirt. Um, so where were we? Yeah, the cute little thing. What I would love to be rebuilding. And the other one also. This one is also really nice. They're gonna like cut it off the around the house. So yeah. They'll probably never be able to sell it without any land, so if they're ever gonna sell it, they'll probably come to me. Reasonable price please. So as far as the land then, it goes still there to the road. The road goes behind this little house. Um, and then, yeah, until where it's like cleared. So, let me see. The sun is almost going down in our Paradise Valley. So, electricity easy to connect. The water is also there on the street. So, that should be very easy. No, and then probably, probably pass here, whoosh, and then down to there. This is where we just were, where the well is for your orientation. It's quite good to see what is the border here. I don't think this is a, this is no, bo this is no border marking, right? because there's even a sort of little path here that still goes up it's eight o'clock at night and it's still like now well maybe now it's 28 but it was like 30, 34 um so yeah still need to fly the drone so we're probably gonna do that now because uh yeah like I said, not so much sunshine. But I'm recording this during golden hour. I'm compensating for my full memory card in my other camera. So, let's see what the drone can do.